There were some new sodas announced today and some seem to be very popular. Let's talk about it. Now, would you say that they are popular or would you say that they are soda euler? Soda euler? That was much better in my head because a lot of times we'll say like, oh, that pop was popular today. Cause like pop, it was pop euler, right? And soda, euler. yeah. Trash that. Soda. -er -er -er. Soda Euler. Soda Euler. That sounds stupid. It sounds like you're trying to say cellular for like a uh, phone. Listen. But it's sodular. I understand. It was a f***ing joke. Or like it's tubular. Like I could see somebody saying that on a surfboard. Would they do one of these? Oh, is yeah. that what they well, do? Oh, hang in 10, baby. Come on. That's the only way to hang. Is it, like, is it like this or is it like this? Oh, I don't know. I think you're doing it the right way. Someone's going to correct me. I know someone will. So the Funko Sodas that were announced today were the Pan Am Stewardess, which is an interesting one, Klondike Cat, Sloth from Goonies, everybody knows him, Bat Mite, he's okay, Neo from The Matrix, that's a popular one, and the Energizer Bunny, who doesn't know about the Energizer Bunny, and then Savoy Fair from Klondike Cat. There you have it. I'm sure there are so many people right now cheering. Chris, say Klondike Cat again because I love him. He's amazing. I need to have Klondike Cat. Yeah, I don't think there's many people out there are saying that. So the one thing that really blew my mind is that they made 18,000, yes, 18,000 of the Energizer Bunny. Well, he keeps going and going. <laughs> Oh my god, I didn't and even going. I'm not I'm not smart enough or and on your going. level level to pick that up. And going. You're brilliant. And going. And going. How do I make this stop? And going. I know how to make this stop. And going. And going. And going. And going. And going. And going. Make it stop! <laughs> You gotta pull my batteries out! Where's your batteries? Ew! What? That's where your fart and poops are! <laughs> I wish you would have said just that's where your farts are. Your poops are in there too. I, how can I say one and not the other? Heather, I know you've been very excited about the Pan Am Stewardess. Did you buy your case of Pan Am Stewardess cans? The, what the f well, don't you love this one? I don't know who this is for. There has to be somebody out there who likes this. Probably flight attendants is my guess. Apparently a Pan Am stewardess is like an old school flight attendant. But I get it. No, no, no. Yeah. It's like the OG of flight attendants. They're a big deal in the flight attendant world. Is there a flight attendant world? Yes. Is it big? Huge. Okay, so let's get away from Pan Am stewardess. She's cool, I guess. How about Klondike Cat and... The Savoy Fair. I don't know who they are, but I'm sure someone would want them. I guess. So apparently these are from like a 60s cartoon. I looked it up on YouTube and, you know, it's a, it looks like a 60s cartoon. I mean, that's it. It looks like a 60s cartoon. I grew up in the 80s. 80s cartoons literally beat everything in my opinion. Wrong. 90s did. Mm, 80s, baby. All the way. You ever seen the Rugrats? <laughs> you ever see He-Man? Transformers. Really G.I. Joe. Heathcliff. Those were the greatest cartoons of our time. Of your time. So the amount of the Energizer Bunny to me is really weird. Why not lower that to like 10K? 18K? I mean, that's a lot. But ad icons are huge. They are huge, but 18K huge? That's ridiculous. That's what they're going to do once they create a Captain America soda. It's going to be a very high count. I can, like, I, I would put money on it. What was Thanos? Mm, well? Why didn't we call him Canos? Because he came in a can? I mean, it takes months. But I finally come up with something brilliant. Canos! I came up with something much more brilliant, but you just shit all over it. What did I poop on? Soda you learn? So Thanos was actually 20,000. So I don't think you're wrong. I think if they make Captain America, he would at least be 20,000. For sure. Yeah, the Iron Man soda was actually 20,000 also. So it appears that characters that aren't as popular, they don't make as many of. However, Sloth is a very popular character and so is Neo from the Matrix, but they're both at 10K. I would expect them to at least hit 15. Sloth is so well known, I figured he'd hit 20. Yeah, that's bizarre. But the Sloth chase is amazing. It's him wearing the... Uh, 
pirate hat. The stewardess is very boring. It's a change of color and the hair. The cat? What is different about the cat? Oh, he's flocked. Uh, it's a flocked cat. Neo, he has his sunglasses on in one of them, and then the other, he's on a phone. Energizer Bunny, it looks like he might be like metallic, I guess, or cr cr chrome color. I, I think know. it's metallic, metallic, and I think it's because the batteries themselves are typically like silver. What they should have done was made him translucent, like the Christmas ornaments that used to come out a long time ago. What the f are you talking about? There used to be ornaments, Christmas ornaments that were Energizer Bunny. We had them when I was a kid. They were pretty awesome, but they should have made it translucent so it matched that. Okay. You're not old enough for this. You're a 90s baby, remember? Sorry. Go back and watch your dumb Rugrats. The Rugrats are awesome. Not better than He-Man or Transformers or Thundercats. I want to hear your dirty little mouth say it. Say what? Say that it's not as good as Transformers, Masters of the Universe, and Thundercats. I've never seen any of those. I can't base an opinion off of things that I've never seen. That's just... not saying that they're better. You're not saying that still. You should be. But the Rugrats are great. They're not as great as that. Whatever. Let us know down below what's better. Rugrats, it's a bunch of farts, or Master of the Universe, Transformers, and Thundercats, right? How come you're allowed to talk about three separate cartoons and I only can have one? Because they're the trifecta. They're teaming up and they're beating the crap out of your Rugrats. You should not ever lay a hand on a baby. Okay, it's a cartoon, so... But you still said that they're getting beat up. You're acting like there's real Transformers and real Thunder, Cats of Thunder. You're acting like there's Cats of Thunder out there running and roaming the streets. And you're wrong. And he, man, he grabbed the sword and he turned to like a superhero. You see me grabbing a hold of a sword and turning it to a superhero? Exactly. Do you see babies? All the time! Babies are stupid. I said it. Our baby audience is going to be very upset about this. What are you going on about? And then Batmite is a 10K. There's a blue and a black one, which is very Batman-like, of course. He always comes in blue or black. So that's cool, I guess, but I really don't know much about Batmite. You can tell me in the comment section down below, but I'll be honest, I, I just, I really don't care. It's cool looking. So Heather, out of this lineup, which one is your favorite? And you're going to say the stewardess. I already know. I think Batmite is the cutest. But I, I'm not really drawn to any of them. I really like the sloth because he is calling to my childhood with that pirate hat. That's amazing. How could you not say it's sloth? I've never watched the... It's because you like Rugrats. It just ruins everything. Once you like Rugrats, you never go back. And then you hate everything else that's in the world. Guys, what do you think about these sodas that were announced? Do you love them or do you hate them? Did you order any? Let us know all of that and more in the comment section down below. Guys, head over to our Patreon to find out how you can support this channel. Yes, you can support this channel. Head over to patreon.com slash gasocast to find out more. If you liked any of these sodas, head over to poppitofftoys.com because they basically have them all except for a couple. I know there's been a couple that sold out, but you can still head over to poppitofftoys.com and see what they have left over. All right, guys, that time again. Remember, as always, we are together, yes. We'll catch you next time. Bye.